I've seen firsthand many restaurant operators who simply go through the motions when it comes to the regular inventory process. Perform an account and then report in the results. And that's it. Operators who do this will likely be losing cash. Poorly managed inventory can hemorrhage profit just as much as staffing can. So we start this series with the question, how often should a restaurant perform an inventory? To start with, it depends on how close you are to attaining your theoretical cost of sale. If you're within 2.5%, then monthly is fine. Anything above that, and you should consider weekly. If you're struggling, then you should also consider a daily line check, which is a focus on the top 10 food and beverage items that are always running at a loss. Plus, counting alone won't solve your issues, so you need to perform an investigation into each line item to see what the issue is. And don't always assume theft. This is your last exhaustive assumption. It's also much more likely that the loss is due to overportioning, wastage, overordering, or a training issue with the chefs. A weekly count might sound like a lot of effort, but I've seen time and time again that restaurants that count more often also have higher profit margins. So much can happen in a week. You can literally sell hundreds of dishes and it's easy to lose control. So it's worth investing the time and effort to count more frequently. A weekly or daily count or line check on average can increase your net profit by 5% annually. So at the end of the day, the question you should be asking yourselves as an operator is, can I afford not to implement this procedure?